I'm Jordan. And I'm Katie. We're both students here at the University of Central Oklahoma. UCO is a great campus that's grown a lot over the years. If you're not familiar with UCO, getting around can be a challenge at first. To help you get around, there's an important place inside the Nye University Center. Let's check it out. We're on the third floor of the Nye University Center. This floor you'll find the Transportation and Parking Services office. It's an office with big glass windows. You can't miss it. The folks behind the counter can help you get around on campus. Here's more from the man that heads up this department. The Transportation and Parking Services mission statement is to effectively and efficiently provide alternative transportation options and parking resources to the university community. My name is Raul Martinez. I am the Director of Transportation and Parking Services at the University of Central Oklahoma. I see ourselves as the first impression that a visitor gets when they come to the campus. Are they able to get around smoothly on campus? Are they able to find the building or the department that they're looking for on campus? If you're bringing a vehicle to campus, you need to come see us. Yes, you need to know what sort of uh, parking decal you need to have on your vehicle. And if you're not coming that often, you only come once a week, maybe parking in a visitor lot may be a better option and you pay by the, the time that you're here. But by coming to see us, we'll be able to provide you the best solution. Students are number one. I mean, that's why we're here. And so the better we can provide transportation and parking solutions for, for our students, um, I think the more they're gonna enjoy coming here every day and the more they're gonna stay here. Make sure this is one of your first stops here at UCO, Transportation and Parking Services in the Nye University Center. Room 309A to be exact. It's the place with the big glass windows. They're open Monday through Friday at business hours to help you get around. I'm Katie. I plan to live here on campus at UCO. And I'm Jordan. I'm a commuter and I'll drive here every day. We'll both have cars here on campus. In order to park here, you have to have one of these decals. Red, green, blue. What do the different color decals mean and how do you get one of them? Let's ask Chip. I work here at the Transportation and Parking Services office. I know pretty much everything you're going to need to know about parking decals. The different colored decals help tell us who's on campus. A red decal means commuter. You drive back and forth to campus every day. Green means you live on campus in campus housing. A blue tells us you work on campus. You're a staff or faculty member. All vehicles on campus, other than those that are parked in the meter or other pay to park lots, must have a decal. Getting a decal is very easy. Just order online at www.uco.edu backslash parking. There are just a few questions. Type of vehicle, the color, tag number, and your address for contact information. Once your decal is ordered, you'll have to pick it up at Transportation and Parking Services. Remember, it's up on the third floor of the Nye University Center. When you pick up your decal in person, it gives us a chance to talk to you. We make sure you get a map of the campus. We let you know all of your options in terms of where to park, and also about the various alternative transportation programs at UCO. Right outside of our offices, we have a big version of the campus map. It's color-coded to help you know who can park where. Remember, red is for commuter students, green for housing students. Dark blue is reserved for faculty and staff 24 hours a day. The light blue areas are also for faculty, but after 4 p.m. anyone can park there. The gray lot, just east of the Nye University Center, is for visitors and those who carpool. Consider carpooling. The yellow-colored area is considered multi-purpose parking. Any valid campus detail can park there. Here's a quick tip about parking. During the fall semester, this area near 2nd Street and University near Howell Hall gets full really fast around the middle of the day. Try instead to park behind the Alumni House or behind the Flat Tire Burger. Consider even parking by the football stadium and then catching the Bronco Link, the bus that circles campus. Remember, park where you're supposed to to avoid getting a ticket. But if you get a ticket, you can pay it online, at the bursar's office, or at the transportation office. If you get a ticket, you are able to appeal it. The information for that is on the back of your parking ticket. Don't forget that decal. Don't get a ticket for not having one. Make sure you place it in the lower corner of the front windshield, on the driver's side. To learn more about decals and parking, go to uco.edu backslash parking. I'm Chip Nolan. I work in the Transportation and Parking Services Office at UCO. We help students get to, from, and around campus. UCO has some great alternative transportation programs. Take a look. If you're a student, faculty, or staff member at UCO, you can bum a bike. The Bum a Bike program allows you to check out a bike for free for up to two weeks. It's a great way to save on gas and get around campus or town. Here's where you can check out the bikes. It's the on-campus Psychology Bike Maintenance Shop. If you use your own bike to get around campus and it breaks down, you can get it repaired right here at the reasonable rates. It's convenient and our way to encourage more people to ride bikes. From bikes to buses. UCO's Bronco Link. The university partners with the City of Edmond to provide this free bus service. 
Apartment complexes located near campus are on the Bronco Link route. And Circles UCO every weekday from 7 in the morning until 6 at night. CityLinkEdmond.com has a posting of specific routes and schedules. This next program is a good way for those who need a car for just a little while. It's called Connect by Hertz. Anyone with a UCO ID and is at least 18 years old can rent a vehicle from Hertz. The vehicle can be rented by the hour or the day. Gas and insurance are included in the rate. The rate is reasonable, as little as $8 an hour. This website will give you more details. This car rental program allows students to run errands or to get away for the weekend. For those with vehicles, consider carpooling. By carpooling, you can park free and know you'll always get a parking spot. Here's how. Carpool, which means riding in a vehicle with two people or more, you'll be able to park for free in the visitor's lot. That's directly across from the now University Center, which is at the heart of campus. As you can see, we have some great alternative transportation programs here at UCO. You can learn more about them by going to uco.edu backslash parking.